Time for the J3C Pigskin Podcast. I'm John. Give me three minutes and I'll give you my three cents. Consider this the audio companion to my weekly college football top 25, which you'll find online at johns3cents.wordpress.com. Big scores and big names highlighted the weekend, but it didn't necessarily mean big movement among the top teams. Sure, six of the top ten ranked teams in action put up at least 40 points on Saturday, but for most, that wasn't really a big surprise. Bama and Oregon did what was expected of them. Ohio State awoke in time to finish off the highest-ranked opponent they've seen during the Urban Meyer era. Stanford managed to affirm their place in the Pac-12 packing order, while FSU and Clemson both stayed the course for an ACC showdown later this month. Now, we did see some closer-than-expected affairs, Georgia-Tennessee and maybe Oklahoma-TCU most obviously, but few upsets and none of those in the top 20. At FSU, Jameis Winston once again looked like the real deal. His sack, not hardly. Touchdown pass was a season highlight reel play. In the Big Ten, Braxton Miller came within inches of being benched, but then prevailed. For South Carolina, Jadavion Clowney surprised his coaches by deciding he didn't want to play or even pretend to, but the poultry carried on at home against Kentucky just about as well without him. Taj Boyd, Amir Abdullah, Duke Johnson, Odell Beckham, those guys all basically did those things that they do. That'll bring us to the J3C Top 25 for the week, where the top 10 teams are unchanged. Alabama, Oregon, Ohio State, and Stanford all still the top four. I did flip-flop FSU and Clemson again this week at five and six. Louisville, Georgia, Texas A&M, and Oklahoma round things out. Baylor makes the biggest jump, up three spots to number 15. Northwestern and Washington slid the most. Both of them fell four. New this week, Fresno State at 21, Nebraska at number 24, Virginia Tech at number 25. Disappearing to make room for them, Maryland, Arizona State, and Ole Miss. Of course, you can see the entire Top 25 every week just by hitting the blog at johns3cents.wordpress.com. Looking to the upcoming weekend, there are a couple of matchups of top 25 teams that will produce some movement in the next poll one way or another. Florida plays at LSU, kicking off 3.30 on CBS, and Oregon goes to Washington. That starts at 4 on Fox Sports 1. Some other games to keep an eye on this weekend include early starts for Missouri at suddenly shorthanded Georgia and the annual renewal of the Oklahoma-Texas rivalry. Northwestern at Wisconsin might get interesting, especially if the Cats are hung over from the loss to the Buckeyes. Stanford at Utah is probably the best early evening game, and it may not be all that good. I figure BYU will be thoroughly embarrassing Georgia Tech. The primetime schedule looks lean to me. Alabama at Kentucky should end up in a rout, and Texas A&M at Ole Miss has lost some luster since the Rebs fell to Auburn and fell out of the top 25. I'm John, and that's my three cents.